Do you think some people forget the black origins of a lot of country oh, music? Of course, of course. There's a great article in Time magazine and the opening line says that the greatest lie in music is to suggest that country music doesn't have a black history. And it does, but it has a white history as well. You know, Doc Watson, Bill Munro, they were listening to black artists. There's no doubt about that. They were listening to work songs and Muddy Waters and, and Lightning Hot. Hopkins and Lead Belly and all those artists. Woody Guthrie toured with, with those people. Yeah, it's a rich melting pot.